Okay, so which one of these compounds is covalent and which ones are ionic? So remember, uh, between nonmetals and nonmetals are covalent compounds, and between metals and nonmetals are ionic compounds. So if you see here, and it doesn't matter how many of the atoms you have together, okay? So you see here, we've got C6 and H6. So there's two atoms, two different types of atoms here. They're both nonmetals. So this is a covalent compound. Okay, here you find um, barium nitride. Okay, barium is a metal. Nitrogen is a nonmetal, right? So this is an ionic compound. Okay. Br2. So what is that? What is that kind of? What does that look like? It looks kind of like Br, Br, right? With a bond between. So Br is a nonmetal. Br is a nonmetal. So it's a covalent compound. Any diatomic element is a covalent compound. Any diatomic element is a covalent compound. Um, here we have aluminum, which is a metal. Oxygen, which is a nonmetal, aluminum oxide. This is an ionic compound. Okay? Sulfuric acid, this is a weird one, okay? Because it's got three different atoms in it. But all three of those atoms are nonmetals, right? So this must be covalent compound. That's it. That's it? That's it? I have a question, but I have a last one. Okay.